tiny mug. <laughs> yummy, yummy, yummy in my tummy. So just You're my favorite little pizza maker in the whole wide world. Yummy pizza. We're gonna teach kids how to make pizza, right? I already know how to make pizza because I made my first pizza. So is Gia. What did you put on your pizza? Cheese. Cheese? And what do we have today that we didn't have last time? Pepper. Pepperoni! Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. But if I smell together, then my hat's not that close together. <laughs> <laughs> I can't see you. <clears throat> Should we tell everyone what we're doing today? Pizza. Pizza. And we've made the recipe really easy, so it's easy for kids to do, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Do you want to start? Do you want to show everyone how to do this? Like what do you put in? So first we're going to put two cups of warm water. So we've got two cups. There's two cups. Mm -hmm. Okay, now you put in the left. You put another one, Mommy. You want Mommy to do it? Yeah, you okay. can do two. Two cups of warm water. Then we're going to put two tablespoons of yeast, active yeast. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And now you put in the salt. That is like one tablespoon of salt. And then we've got one tablespoon of agave nectar, which is like a natural alternative as a sweetener. <laughs> I'm gonna get all that in there. Get out. Mm. I have it in my coffee every morning, don't I? And then we've got a quarter of a cup of olive oil. Oil di olive. Okay, just up a little bit. Put our flour. We've got five cups of flour here. We're gonna pour most of it in, right? See? Too way too much. It goes slow, otherwise it's gonna go everywhere. So this is a really simplified pizza dough recipe. And there's still a little bit more this. Yeah, you can add in. If you have an electric mixer, it would be a lot easier for you. Eat, eat, eat. And make sure all the ingredients are like in there. A little bit. Add a little bit more flour. Ah, I just washed my hands. <gasps> <laughs> okay, see what mommy's doing? Oh. Kind of like... Okay, you do that because I do not want to get my hand dirty again. I'll do the dead messy part, okay? You said dead messy part? I'll do the messy part. <laughs> That's what you want to do? Okay, maybe you're not going to use this spoon because it makes see, these little holes in it. The next step is we're going to pour this flour. Do you want to pour the flour over the table? We're gonna need this to Good job. And if our oven should be preheated to 500 degrees, right? Yeah. Alright, do you wanna put the dough? We're gonna need it. Good job. Alright, now you can eat. So do you want mommy to give you a little I'll give you a little kneading lesson. And then you go. Bring these two in, and then we're going to push it. You yes, turn it and push it. Turn it, push it. Turn it, push it. Good job. And then the top up here and push it. Push it this way. Yeah. Okay, sit over this side. Mommy's going to finish it. Do you want to cut it? Okay. Six. Put your hand on top. Go slow. I'm going to cut this into two pieces, but good job. Okay. So we're going to make individual pizzas. So we're just going to make these into balls. All right. Then we're going to spray the baking sheet. And we're going to put them on our baking sheet and cover with glad wrap. I want the thing. Okay, now we're going to put our dough there. Let's just like coat it in a bit of oil. Like that. We're gonna make sure they're kind of oil. Coat them in a bit of oil, yeah. Ah. Mm. You know, that side I have to Alright, 
So our dough is finished. Yeah, let's take this glad wrap off. They got big, didn't they? Yeah, big. So big. Bigger if it's going to put the wrapping paper on. Okay, and which pizza do you want to make? Which one looks good to you? Eeny, miny, mo. This one? Yes. Okay. Let's, um, we're going we're gonna to spread out some flour because you're going to roll your pizza out. Ooh, roll the dough. And you're going to roll him out. Let's put this on the... This is much easier. On the oh, side. no. Oh, oh no. Oh, God. Dude. Oh. Okay. You can just uh, get a different one. Oh, come on, Mom. Let's just... wasting pizza. Let's try not to... Um, let's put some flour on top so it doesn't get stuck. Okay. There you go. That looks pretty good. I'm gonna get this guy. Let's try and make him into a circle. That looks good to me, buddy. That looks great. We've run out of our spray greasing, so we're just gonna pour some oil into it. You could use wax paper or parchment paper. We're just gonna rub it in there. And then, you want mommy to do this part? Just tuck it up. So we've got some sauce. Not too much, because it will make it soggy. So we've just basically got just a marinara sauce out of the jar keeping it really simple for all the mums out there we're just going to spread that red sauce all over the base we've got our oven preheated to 500 degrees just in the middle we're going to leave like a border around the edge just even out a little bit mm. you like it all right you want to add your cheese yummy 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 <clears throat> yummy 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 in my tummy careful you don't get the cheese because it's going to burn if we put it on the edge Fill in the gaps. Some pepperoni. Awesome, dude. You're my favorite little pizza maker in the whole wide world. Yummy pizza. Let's chuck this one in. And put it on the bottom shelf. Yeah! Oh, there's a little bit of cheese. Right there, right there. Oh, good save, good save. Now let's get Amy, Money, Mo. Oh, God, they're sticking together. Alright, mommy, do you want? Oh, can I help I'll you? I'll do one quick. Yeah, totally. Which one is? Oh, can I roll it out? I'd love you to help me. Yeah, let me just put some flour on. I'll roll it out because rolling it out is fun. I would like caramelized onions, goat cheese. That's nasty. I think I know what I'm going to put on my pizza. I'm going to make mine with cheese, truffle salt, pesto, and capers. My so oh, can I eat my sauce? You want to eat this? Yeah. No, dude. Let me eat my sauce. No. Yummy, yummy. <laughs> See if I can do this. Oh, that did not work. All right. Let's see if look a little goofy. Okay, it's going to taste good and that's all that matters. Mmm, mm, mm. tasty fast. You like it? Mm-hmm. We're just using marinara sauce. You can buy pizza sauce, but we just use whatever we had in the cupboard, right? Mm. We just make it work, don't we, Z? Tasty sauce. That's enough, buddy. That's enough. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> well, can you put pepperoni on mine, please? I want some pepperoni. I'm going to add some basil. They say basil. And you know, in Australia, we call this basil. Basil. But we call it basil in, in Texas. That's good. And mommy's favorite ingredient for pizza. It's full of yumminess. Some capers. Okay, this is our secret trick, right, see? Yeah. We grate parmesan cheese around the edge of the pizza to get the crust really parmesan-y and crispy. Crispy? What do you mean crisp? Like... <laughs> All right, now we're gonna put this in the oven too. Bye! Yummy, yummy, yummy. 10 minutes. In the oven. Okay, let's chop it up. Don't chop it. Oh, this is a really sharp knife. So I fell down. You fell down? Mm. There you go, Lee. So you're teaching other kids how to make pizza. Do you think it was easy? Yep, mommy. Mm. Oh my god. Good job, buddy. Mm. So there you go, a really quick and easy mm. pizza recipe for kids. It's a good little bonding experience, right? We love doing it. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's too yummy. That's too yummy.
is mommy's pizza. There is mommy. And the good thing about this is you can turn a pizza night into an educational cooking night. So even though pizza is not the best thing for your kids to eat, it could be an amazing bonding experience and educational too. All right, guys, and that is plated. And make sure to comment and like below. And we'll see you again next week. Say bye. 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 He's going to take off with his pizza now. And that is plated. What do you think, bud? Okay. <laughs> it's hot.